Coming up next, a UFC welterweight division matchup. Well, the crowd pops as this guy makes the walk to the octagon, and you can see why if you've watched film on him. This is a true mixed martial artist, plus skills in all areas, and figures to be a handful, really, for anybody in this division. Probably comfortable tonight anywhere the fight goes. Truly a well-rounded MMA fighter. You know, we, we, we trot that term out there a lot. This guy fits the bill. This guy is a very well-rounded fighter. He can do it all. If the fight takes place standing or on the ground, he's going to be comfortable in all areas of the game. He is the founder of Jeet Kune Do, and as Dana White calls him, the father of modern mixed martial arts, Bruce Lee. Outstanding striker, very dynamic on the feet, so unpredictable, great combination of precision and timing. And Bruce Lee was quoted as saying, the best fighter is someone who can adapt to any style. Bruce Lee is nothing if not adaptable, perhaps the most influential martial artist of all time. This guy has one of the best abilities to take a shot that I have ever seen in all my years of commentating on fights. His chin is truly world class. Our tale of the tape for this welterweight fight. So a more than five year gap between these two fighters when it comes to the age, with big differences in height, but some differences in reach. All right, to get us started with the official introductions, here is Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, he's looking. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the Saitama Super Arena in Tokyo, Japan! It's time! Five rounds in the UFC Welterweight Division. Introducing first, fighting! This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet three inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Manchester, England, the first And now it's his opponent fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! Okay, guys, protect yourself at all time, will be my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to I the am corner. very fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming. The fans have been anticipating this for a long time, and it is gonna go Ready? down right Ready? now. While the UFC live events keep on coming, we are underway from the world-famous Saitama Super Arena in Tokyo, Japan. All right, here he is, the founding father of modern MMA, Bruce Lee, ready to go for round one. The speed and the angles just absurd, and a hard guy to simulate in training. You think you got a beat on him, and then you end up twitching on the canvas. So we'll see how the opponent chooses to defend Bruce Lee here in the early go. Glance a glancing right hand upstairs. All right, so here we go with round one. There is no denying just how much power this fighter has in his kick. So let's see how early he chooses to attack with it. Does he go low to the leg? Does he go high to the head? Let's see how the early portions of this fight play out. Oh, and there is that head kick, Joe. You've been calling for that strike all night long, and that one was pretty effective. Nicely landed. He counters with a big hook. Body kick, look at that. Very methodical. Really threw a lot of power into that uppercut, but missed. Oh, big shot. 
Well, you're playing with fire there. He left the body wide open there, and he has shown an increased vulnerability. Big kick to the head. He's got He's gotten hurt here. Blocks the shot. Oh! There's a nice kick. Lee gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Swing and a miss with that straight left hand. Look at that, he's timing that jab. Avoids the clinch here. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Just out of the range with that right hand. Good defense there. How about that chin? Didn't quite connect. Clipped him with the right hand there. Back and forth we go. Just out of range with that right hook. Going to the body there with the right kick. Oh, huge right hand. This could be it. Oh, he might be out. to be vulnerable to that strike coming back. Got to get his head off the center line. Blocks that kick to the body. Goes to the body there. Oh! Attempts a big hook to the head, but misses. Beautiful jab. And he lands yet another strike to the body. Pinpoint placement right underneath the elbow. He got tagged there. He hit him with an axe kick. Very nicely done. Clean punch. Forty-five seconds to go here in round one. Oh, slips the punch there, Joe. Nice punch by Lee. That one hurt. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Really missed with that right hand. Lee gets touched by that kick right to the body there. Nicely done by the opponent. Misses a huge hook to the head. That's a big block, Joe. It appears. Oh. 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 Round two is next. All right, so that's the end of the round. He got cut on his eyebrow in that round. This bears watching moving forward. Not the worst location for it necessarily, but the cut man's got to get in there and prevent that cut from bleeding and trickling down into the eye. And here's a big strike to the head that stuns. And here's another devastating shot to the head that really does damage. And here's another shot to the head that really stuns. Several near fight ending moments in that round. Lots of action. Two here. He's definitely going to want to start this round off fast to try to pick up where he left off. His opponent was in big trouble at the end of that round. Pretty evenly matched in terms of the significant strikes thrown and landed. 
so he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes up. Nice defense there. Huge block. Another shot lands upstairs. Head kick. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. That's a nice clean shot. Well, the offense has been there. He is landing some good shots, but not really stringing them together and putting combinations on his opponent. He's got to mix up his strikes, change his tempo a little bit, and try to get his opponent out of there by landing more than just one strike at a time. He's in big, big trouble here. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. Body kick, look at that. He didn't miss with that uppercut. Missed that shot. Slightly deflected. Oh, buckled him there. Beautiful shot to the body. Nice. Just missed with the huge kick. And he lands the roundhouse. Tries a big hook to the head, but misses. That left hook is very dangerous. Just over three minutes to go. Left hand there inside. Oh, huge block. Man, has he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two. Definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. Oh, and he connects with a punch yet again. He has attacked that area nonstop, probably targeting the cut, I would think, at this point in time. And he lands a nice kick. Beautiful right hook. He's got him right here. That one appeared to stun him. Big shots. Big, Big body shot. To the body. Oh. Wow. This could be it right here. Hit him oh, hard so with that hook. With that hook, Joe. Two minutes now to go in round two. Oh, gosh. He's definitely oh. rocked. Oh. As he is, he looks to improve position here. Into full guard. Nice reversal. He tries to pass here, but gets shut down. Nice sweep here. He's got half guard. Excellent movement on the ground here, always trying to better his position. Oh, good left hand. Man, his face is a mess. He's looking to work that mounted crucifix. Side control again. He's gonna try to take the back, I think. Back to side control. Oh, this is not good. It's the elbow there. Good punch. Excellent posture here. Oh, he got reversed. He's working from his back now. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Big punch from the bottom. Lee gets caught with that punch. Well, back to his feet, Joe, but man, is he hurting. Looking for the left hook. Going to the body there with the right kick. Here's a vicious kick that results in a knockdown.
And here's a liver shot that does some real damage. And let's see that from another angle. Brittany Palmer in the building. I need you to protect that eye, too. I need you to protect this cut. It's getting too bad now. I don't want it to be stopped because you can't protect that cut. Are you ready? You ready? Third oh. round underway. for the fences with that hook, but misses. Oh, oh, big shot. He's got him hurt here. Well, he's up. Oh, oh. The left hook hits home. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. A huge roundhouse kick for the knockout. Oh, absolutely one for the highlight reel right there. A tremendous kick to spell the end of the night for his opponent and for him, I should say, but just caught him flush, full force, beautiful extension on the kick, and the fight was really over as soon as that one made contact. I'm not even sure he was conscious when he hit the canvas. Outstanding performance here tonight. And there he is, all smiles. What a huge knockout he turned in here tonight. That is one they'll be talking about for some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest at 48 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce Lee. Mixed martial arts royalty, folks. Bruce Lee, lighten up your living room tonight and given this capacity crowd a whole lot to cheer about. You know he's gonna get everyone's best shot, but more often than not, Lee's skills are enough to rue the day. That was once again the case in this one. How about Bruce Lee?